Hello everyone, are you ready for another adventure? It's me, Wokey, and I'm here with Zenrot. Say hello, Zen. Hello. And we're here with uh, something that I wanted to show Zen called Monster Crown. It is, as he said when he was looking it up, is this edgy Pokemon? <laughs> and I said, yeah, kind of. It is uh, basically Pokemon. This thing has like, I think a thousand monsters in here. I'm going to click new game. Damn, uh, a thousand? I think something like that. It's also on PC, so what is my name? Let's go with the very simple Wookie. All right. Uh, a very important here. We will go with uh, he. Usually I play uh, women, though. We can check out all these sick customizations. Very, very, very uh, hairstyles. I'm going to go with the hat. What color palette would I like? I like this one because it reminds me of old... Uh, Game, remember the Game Boy Color when you had um, the option to just have the weirdest fucking color palettes in the history of mankind <laughs> for no reason other than you Yeah, could. wait, why is it just your whole body tints when you change that? Yeah, I assume it's a reference to when the Game Boy Color could do that. Um, so, yeah, this is basically Pokemon. Uh, oh, it's our dad. Yeah, it's our dad. Lucky we're only here for a few minutes and we get to go home, pal. So, it's important to remember this land are home to monsters of all shapes and sizes, so whenever you're out in the wilderness, you have to be extra careful. You have to get a monster to protect yourself, don't go out without a map, very simple stuff. Let me tell you the difference between a man and a monster, and then he's going to tell me how to really live life <laughs> on the edge. You look like a monster, Dad. He does kind of look like a monster. Monsters. You look like a creepy snake man. <laughs> he could at any moment. However, mankind is resourceful. Many years ago, divine symbols were discovered that, when printed on a scroll, allows monsters and man to form a pact to offer benefits to both. Mankind's intelligence and ability to travel allow their companion monsters to face a variety of challenges, grow strong, while the strength of a monster offers protection and power. As you would expect. But don't forget, Wokey. And then he never tells me. Oh, never mind. Edge. Evil. Damn, that's really edgy looking screenshot. <laughs> it is. Just full hair. Dad, tell me what. Seeking power of all else comes at a price none of us are prepared to pay. So they're saying you want to be the best, but don't want, don't be too good of the best. All right, there we go. All right, let's go. All right, let's go out there. Oh, I forget what... Alright, yes, hello, good day. I forget how to run in this. Because this game is built very janky. Actually, very reminiscent of old Pokemon games in that it's also kind of jank. <laughs> like the old ones. Uh, yes. Go. Press B, got you. I have to go up to stuff and press B. I just don't remember what. No, it's down here, I think. Alright. Live in the simple farm life. Actually, I don't know which one of these is B. There we go. I have to feed it to one of these monsters, guys. There we go. Eat eat up. Eat up, buddy. Eat it. Eat the pumpkin. <laughs> Seems happy about it. All these pumpkins are going to this one exact monster. Field cleared. Let's oh, the field is clear. Is that like our homie? I think, I think that's my dad's monster. Uh, later. Uh, yes, I, he says now to show you what real monster taming looks like. That's a Rodas. Ah, it's Rodas. Masked the masked rodent. rodent. <laughs> That's our dad's. Welcome to Monster Battle. Let me show you around. This is how you ah, attack. Ah, it's Tidon. Thanks yeah, for showing me around. I've never played Pokemon <laughs> before, so. Yeah, very important. It's funny because you think Pokemon is definitely one of those games you don't have to tell anyone how to do because it has not changed in 30 years. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> really. Swipe is relentless. Got you. Shows you right there what's weak, what isn't weak, type advantage boost, simple stuff. I think now he tells me to catch it? That's a lot of damage. It is a lot of damage. Go on, try to recruit him. Easy offer, sir. I offer you death or you join me. And it <laughs> looks like he's chosen to join me. Wow, <laughs> he wasn't really impressed with that attack. A few level higher than them. You got a grasp for the basic submission for you. You're a natural. Perfect. 
Monsters will want nothing to do with someone like you, not unless you have something to give it. In return, monsters value for power, territory, food, that's just scrap scraping the surface. You're gonna need some packs to convince them to join you. To understand it well enough to either accept or decline. From there, you'll either have to join you, or well, why don't you just give it a try? I'll let you borrow my t -dun. Just be careful with him, he's up nasty, but he's quite as tame as he could be. Got t on <laughs> Which sounds Hell wrong. Hell yeah. Go out the road and find the biggest, toughest Primagon and you can plow those fields. If you tame anything else, you'll have to release it. Remember, this monster is for the farm. You won't be able to take anything you tame now into your adventure. Alright, let's go. Come on, What about our What about our rat? Rat? That row mask? Uh, I think right now- oh shit, I forgot. Follow me, dude. There we go. Alright. I can tell him to just sit. Like, if I press Y. Just sit there. Uh, I, that was the tutorial. I forget. Okay, is this the thing we need to catch? Primagon, there it's we go. It's Primagon! Wow, it sure looks weird. a lot like the last guy. Does look very similar. Alright, let's see. Swipe, easy. Join me, fool. You've been swiped at. You know my full power. Here's my pact. He accepts. <laughs> very easily. Yeah, I, again, I feel like he's like, well, you know, the alternative is death, so... Yeah. He doesn't want the death. Yeah, I got a big strong one. Since you did a great job, last week we made the trip into Charity Kingdom. Brought you a comic book, why don't you take a break and maybe give it a read? Oh, don't forget to check the back cover. There's something there I want you to see. And it's a nudie mag. And it's like, Dad, whoa. Awesome. <laughs> All because I caught a Pokemon. <laughs> the comic is interesting and enjoyable, but it's not the first issue, so the story is hard to follow. The trials and tribulations of comic Zen. <laughs> it's so hard. <laughs> And on the back cover, you find a personality quiz. Answer these questions and mail them in with 1G to win your own monster. Question 1, Zen. You participate in 5k race. What do you do? You strive to win. You never give up. You trip up your rival, set up a dangerous trap, or ditch the race. Uh... I don't know. What do we never give up, I think. You'd never give up? I would straight up ditch the race. I'm not running 5k, but I'm gonna go with you. <laughs> never give up. <laughs> When it comes to music, you prefer thrash metal, hard rock, classical, dance, punk. I prefer punk. Yeah, I was about to say, I, you're not really a dance music kind of guy to me. <laughs> For a hobby, you prefer playing mind games, then? Is that what you prefer to do on your own time? That's, yeah, that's my, that's my hobby, yeah. Just <laughs> fucking in, with people's brains. Getting into fights. That's just true if you follow Zen on Twitter. Playing chess, exercising, <laughs> or playing pranks. None of these things, really. None of these. Not a fan of chess, really? You never play chess? I mean, it's not, like, my hobby, though. No. I feel like it really is between one of these two. I think playing mind games kind of is just saying playing Yu-Gi-Oh. But you also, <laughs> like... Yeah, that's... Yeah, we'll do that. Alright, we'll assume this means playing Yu-Gi-Oh. Time to mail in and see what happens. Surely, what are the chances of me winning one week later? Right. I've won. Wait. All right. It's time to wake. Oh, good morning. What's with the expression? Oh, no, today is you're expecting to get a monster in the mail, aren't you? I wish you would have asked me before you sent that. It sounds an awful lot like a scam. <laughs> I mean, it, it's behind a comic. It's trustworthy. Don't feel bad, Wookie. We all fall for those things at times. When I was a girl, I sent money into sweepstakes for x-ray glasses, but they never came. Now, why don't you go see if your father... Knock, knock, knock. Wookie, you better hurry on out here. I don't think this cage is going to hold much longer. Ah, shit. It actually worked out. Oh, yes, you, young boy. You sure that Wookie is old enough to handle this? Of course, Wookie's already 14. That's when you get your demon. <laughs> That's when you get you make your pact with demon. Your natural demon pact. Exactly. That's plenty old enough. <sighs> well, it came with all the appropriate paperwork, I guess. Just sign here and tick off the type of monster next to its record, okay? Hoopla! <laughs> uh, um, Ambigu is recommended for you. Press up and down to keys to pick. So we've got Hoopla, Kenite, Darwall, <laughs> Dracoi, Ambigu. Uh, Ambigu looks awful. It looks like it is uh, some form of suffering, for sure. Yeah, it looks unstable. like it's in pain. It's also unstable. But this is what your personality quiz got us in. 
You're oh, gonna... Ambigu is the one that we're passing? <laughs> they say Ambigu is our choice. An unstable blob of agony <laughs> is what we got. Yeah, that's what it's saying You know right what? Now. That's pretty accurate, I think. Alright, we're gonna go with our boy Ambigu then. Are you sure this is the monster for you? Yes. He's I don't know, man. I like that whale. Oh, God. Look at I did like the whale. <laughs> look at him. It looks like he's suffering. <laughs> He does. He looks like he's in absolute agony. It'll be. <laughs> <laughs> Shoot me. Oh, look at this little one. It must be a first level. I've never seen one like this before. <laughs> I can't even tell what type it is. Unstable? Brute? No, it's definitely relentless. It's, it literally says, What will get you off the hook for farming today? Why don't you spend some time training your new monster and seeing how it grows? Go fight some of the monsters outside the farm and come talk to me when your buddy here is a bit stronger. I might have a job for a young monster tamer who shows some potential. Alright. Come on, Mbugu. Raise your monster level to convince your dad you're ready for a real life tamer. Party XP is on, but you can toggle it off because this game Hell really yeah. un really understands Pokemon. Because <laughs> this game watches Twitter when new Pokemon games come out and they're like, alright, hang on. Yeah. Exactly. Oh, you got a pumpkin? Can you give it right. to your, your, your yeah. fella? Yeah. Oh, he's happy here. about it. He is. Oh god, it's a it's a road ask. No, it's, I think this is the premise. Primagon. Oh, it's yes, yeah, Primagon. Ah, ah shit. <laughs> We're ready. Slime slap. Let's Ew, go. Oh. <laughs> Absolutely disgusting. Let's see one of the most smother. Ow. Truly <laughs> smothers the foe. All right. Smother, get out of here. Yeah, a little level up. I think it's level six. We can probably go talk to dad and see if we're strong enough boys to go out into the wilderness. Let me go feed my- I got another little, another little punk- Oh god, the Primagon! Yeah, you can leave- Ah, oh, shit. Alright, fine, fuck it. Let's wait. You can also see the Pokemon zone. That's what makes it truly different. Slime slap! Think- Oh, wow! Oh, one damn. shot! <laughs> Absolutely, Absolutely powerful! whooped his ass! He may be an abomination to God, but he is our abomination to God. Here you yeah, go, Yeah, I'm, I'm starting to like him more. He kinda, yeah. I like how you gotta put it in his mouth. He, like, he can't <laughs> turn and take it. No, he can't. Alright, let's see. I think I... Uh, damn it, I can't go down here. Come on, come over here. Alright, they don't want it. I'm gonna fight this guy right here. Maybe they were right. The personality quiz did say that you would really like um, um, Bigu. I'm kinda turning around on him. He's just so strong with his giant slime. <laughs> The disgusting slime tentacle. Yes. All right. Level six. Let's go. All right, Ambigu. Let's go see if Dad thinks I'm strong enough now. Wow, the monster's already getting tougher. Are you aware of how trade relationships work? No. Maintain a good standing with other towns to access things we need. Food, I'm oil. I'm fucking that sort fourteen. Of thing. You think I understand <laughs> inner town trade? Er, economics aside, it's customary to give gifts to the king to show goodwill. We're pretty far from all three kingdoms, but I'd like to get into the good books of the closest one, at least. I'd like you to be the one to deliver the gift. On the way home last week, I stopped in with an old friend of mine. He's a fisherman, and he offered me a beautiful pearl, and he found a way out of sea. Take a look at it, won't you? I'd like you to take this humanism kingdom and deliver it directly to King Tenna. I just know it'll be a good impression. Along the way, it'll be a great opportunity for you to train your monsters and find some new ones to tame. I know it's scary leaving home. I wouldn't ask you if I didn't think you could handle it, 14-year-old boy. Your mom and I will always be here for you if you get hurt. You're showing quite <laughs> a bit of talent if as a If you tamer. fucking die on the road and you make it home. <laughs> yes. Because, again, these are demons. <laughs> they, these are actual monsters, not Pokemon. And I know what you are always wanting to do. It'll be fun. Here, take this island map and a few more packs for the road. Got five normal packs. Call me from the general store in Milltown when you get there, okay? I'm sure you'll be fine, but I'm still your dad after all. All right, Dad. Uh, can you heal me, by the way? Yeah, heal heal up my Ambigu real quick. Thank you. The boy needs the heal. Oh, uh, I was gonna say maybe he just chill in the room. Can I talk to you? No, I'm good. All right, let's roll. Oh damn, he ran out ahead of you. He's like, ah, fucking gotta get out of here. <laughs> Listen, uh, you well, thank you, mom, for. Uh, oh yeah, there's five monster types. I got you. I understand how this world works. I think, wait, what is, what did mom just tell me to do? Meet her outside? She gonna fight me? Oh, it's the thing I caught! Alright, maybe a little bit, but I hope you're prepared. We're gonna fight mom. 
Oh, no, she's showing me how to swap monsters, okay. Nah, she has her own <laughs> mom spray. Check this out. Synergy Gauge. If you swap monsters during battles, the synergy level will build. When you finally attack with synergy, it unleashes power up of your attack. Watch and learn. Okay. I'm watching. I'm gonna defend. No, that's... This is the defend button. Okay. You both defended yourself. I'm gonna some other Let's see what happens here. Tidon defended itself. I'm not sure what my mom is trying to show me, Zen. Yeah, oh, how, she's we can't she's, switch. No, we can't switch, but I'm saying, okay, she's building up the gauge. I see it now. Ow, that almost <laughs> one-shot me. I think this is just a way for my mom to bully me. Oh, this thing's fucking level 10? Seems unfair. I'm just one Pokemon. <laughs> yep, there I go. No option. Only option is to run in fear. <laughs> ah, that was so much fun. Keep in mind that building monster synergy can do much more than increase attack power. That was so much fun. I beat the absolute piss out of your little thing. It's okay, Ambigu. We will grow you strong. Look, even in his idol animation, he just looks like... <laughs> like, the other ones aren't moving that way. <laughs> he's just moving in such a way that just makes him feel like he's in constant shifting between our universe and his. <laughs> <laughs> he's trapped in between. Yes, exactly. In the void. In the void. Free me, master. Oh, I think I pulled a muscle. Alright, well, we got our ass handed to us by mom, but it's okay. That was to show us the synergy stuff. If I remember how to use synergy, so it should be fine when we actually do it. Alright, I think it's fine. We will stop for now, and we will continue on, because I want to show you at least what happens in the next town, and then we'll see if we ever want to continue this. <laughs> but it's at least... Okay. It's got some interesting stuff it's in cute. it. It's cute. I kind of like it. Yeah. Yeah. It's got some stuff going on to it that I kind of appreciate, and it has that right level of jank that I think is necessary for Pokemon <laughs> games funny enough. We'll be right back, everyone. Say goodbye. Goodbye. Soon.